Russia's invasion of Ukraine continues, and so do the discussions on how the worsening geopolitical, economic, and social factors may affect pretty much all segments of the wider society. Two crypto exchanges shared their views with crypto news. Calm on what may await the crypto market, and what segments are the most threatened. Although the recent escalation has tanked most risk on assets, crypto included, the situation between Russia and Ukraine has been developing and escalating for a while. The ongoing decline in crypto prices suggests much of its potential fallout has already been priced into the market, said Rick D. However, he noted that a sudden recovery is unlikely as investors wait to see how the US central bank, the Federal Reserve, will adjust interest rates in light of recent geopolitical developments. Even longer term, we could expect to see a little changes fundamentally about crypto as an asset class, he added. Meanwhile, the aggressor may be using Bitcoin, BTC, in light of the sanctions imposed upon him, while Ukraine is asking for donations in BTC, Ethereum, ETH, and Tether, USDT. Brendan Almond, Chief Marketing Officer at the Unison Exchange, told Crypt News. Calm that we saw crypto markets reacting positively with the Russian military operation because the Russian government will leverage BTC to risk their financial system from the impact of the sanctions. Thalman too. The industry is facing an industry-wide witness test, where weak projects will be sidelined in favor of startups with sustainable business models and capital structure will shine in the months to come, he said. As to the indicators that may suggest what's coming next, Dalman said that yet, not all crypto industry segments are built the same, and it stands to argue that some would be more vulnerable in times of geopolitical and economic uncertainty than others. Dalman noted that, due to last year's Financial Action Task Force FADF, updated guidance on AML, KYC, anti-money laundering slash know your customers, decentralized finance, DeFi, will be under severe threat. He said that, DeFi is now stepping directly into core financial industries like fixed income. The same is true for the DeFi and the NFT niches, which are still largely driven by speculation alone. 